Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to tell you how you can install a compiler for running your C program. Uh, we are going to go to our website and the, you can type it as ninjw and when you go to this website you can find the first link as sourceforge.net just click on that link as soon as you click you will be directed to this kind of interface and you can see a download button just click download and your download will start shortly uh, wait for some time uh, here you can see we have downloaded ninjw get dot setup just click on that and say install you can see where it is going to be installed c slash ninjw it means it is going to be installed in the c directory and say continue and uh, you can find it will start uh, connecting this is going to take some time be patient and uh, uh, wait for some time uh, till it is downloaded all the files and installed uh, click on continue and uh, you will be asked which all packages you want to install here you can see uh, there are many packages listed uh, if you want to run even C++ program you can choose this and uh, you can say mark for installation and then you can go for this C programming execution file see this is a C++ compiler okay. and uh, this is objective C compiler you can choose this also if you want you can choose everything but it is going to take bit more time but uh, since I am going to install only these three uh, go for installation and then click on apply changes and say apply this is also going to take some time can see all the changes that are being applied now you can see all the changes were applied successfully and you may close this dialog now close and we can close this even after doing all that you must be thinking that we are going to use the compiler straight away but that is not the case mm, for checking that one just type here CMD, it will take you to the command prompt. Just type here GCC space version, and you are going to see that GCC is not recognized as an internal or external command. That's why we need to add an environment variable into the system so that system knows that something like this exists. For that, we can do this. Go to this PC and uh, just look for the minjw folder click here go to bin folder and copy the path we are copying this path because we need to tell the system that there are mm, some files like gcc g++ so that uh, the system will know whenever we are typing the command after copying this path we will go to the search bar type here env and it is going to give you edit the environment variable just click on this and we'll go to this window and in this search for environment variable it will be here just click here and in this path just click on this path and say edit and say new and paste the path that you have brought say ok go to the system variable here also do the same thing just, just double click on that and you come here just type new and paste the link paste the path that you have brought and say ok and say ok and say ok after closing all the files you need to again open your command prompt 
and now you type gcc slash version now you can see that uh, the gcc has been installed successfully if you have got any queries and if you are facing any problem please let me know in the comment section below and please subscribe this channel and press the bell icon if you really like this video thank you